SMS Turbo's unattended ticketing solutions can be configured with a wide variety of different hardware options, ranging from fully weatherized unattended kiosks mounted at the scale for direct driver interface to standard PC hardware that can be located inside of a secure scale house. Today we're going to take a look at a weatherized unattended kiosk configured with a PLC and touchscreen display. In this section of the video, we're going to create a ticket with the unattended terminal whereby there are no default values set for any of the items that need to be selected. That means that we will be prompted to select each and every data point involved in this ticket. You'll notice that the system currently says waiting, and this is because there is no weight currently on the scale. When we simulate a truck pulling on the scale, the system will present the first prompt. In this case, it's enter or select truck. Now we could use the keypad at this point to be able to enter a truck directly into the field or we can use the view list option to select from a list of available trucks that are available to choose from. When using the view list, if the entire list doesn't fit on the screen at once, we have the page up and page down buttons so that we can scroll through the available options. We're going to pick truck 200 for this particular ticket. The next prompt is for the customer. Again, we'll use the view list and I'll select Andrew Hall. The next prompt is for the order or job, and again we can use the view list, and I'll pick the Ambrose order. Now it's asking us to select the material that's being ticketed, crushed rock, and lastly it's asking for us to select the location. We'll say that this is going to Amherst. At this point, the system is capturing the tear weight from the scale indicator as well as capturing an image from the cameras attached to the system. The driver can now exit the scale, receive his load, and proceed back to the scale when he is ready to weigh out. When the truck pulls back up on the scale with the load on the truck, the system will prompt for the truck again. We can use the view list. And now when we select that same truck, the system finalizes the ticket immediately because all of the information has already been entered. The system will then print the ticket for the driver. The driver can take the ticket and proceed on their way. In this section of the video, we'll create a ticket on the opposite end of the spectrum. In this particular case, every value has a default value and the only thing that the driver needs to enter is the truck ID. We'll put some weight on the scale. The driver will use the view list to select the truck in question, and the entire ticket is completed. The ticket is printed, and the driver goes on his way. In all likelihood, most customers' unattended ticketing needs fall somewhere between these two extreme examples. In this last example, we will create a ticket where the truck has an associated customer with a default order and location, but the driver needs to select the material that is being picked up. We will use the view list selection to select the truck. The order and location have already been set, but we'll use the view list to select the material that the driver is picking up. The weight and images are captured and the ticket is finalized. 